The right lobe is enlarged and has a large, echinormal nodule. The lesion has small cystic areas and halo. The lower pole is clearly seen on longitudinal scan. The echogenic granules are probably related to cystic areas. The nodule has both paranodular and intranodular blood flow. The contralateral lobe became atrophic which is the usual finding in hyperthyroidism caused by autonomously functioning adenoma. Now, we check the diameter of the trachea, now at a lower level, and now at the level of the upper third of the thyroid.